Let's hit it. Me and Davo is traveling up to Dargo tonight. Um, we've got Barney from Legendex, As As Ventures, Steve from Australian 4x4 Adventures, and Race and Jason all heading up this weekend. Well, actually, it's Sunday night. It's something different. They reckon snow down to 400 meters tonight, so that is gonna be just like mind blowing. We're all fueled up. Uh, we've had dinner, it's seven o'clock at night. We'll get there probably about 10, probably about a three hour drive for us. So stay tuned, go grab a beer, get some popcorn, whatever you want to do. This is going to be sick. So we're made it to Dargo. Davo's just gone and grabbed the key from Stevo for the uh, the gate behind the puppy. The boy. And uh, yeah, we go in, set up camp. Good morning. It's about seven o'clock Monday morning. He's waking up next to the river. Davo, hey, your morning, mate. Living the dream. Crew here, so Barney from okay. Legend X and As from As Ventures in Australia. Yeah, yeah I was, I'm, do. I'm horrible with names. <laughs> yeah. The link will be in the description. Link, <laughs> link down below, guys. <laughs> guys nickname's Gold because he forgets everything. Yeah, I forget everything. Hit anyway. that bell, mate. Hit that bell. Yeah. Like, and subscribe. like and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications, all that stuff. Um, hit that Billy Goats today. It should be freaking awesome. There was meant to be a whole heap of snow around. I don't know if it's going to happen or not. Keen uh, as cross, fingers crossed. Keen as. So we've promised the Queen, the Northerners. Northerners. The Northerners. Yeah. <laughs> you Mexicans. <laughs> uh, promise them some snow. Mm, I don't know if we're going to get it or not yet. I'll so. turn the freezer on now and we'll make some ice blocks just in case. <laughs> we'll just start shaving some, some uh, icicles. It is cold enough. It, it feels feel cold. cold. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> no, it should be good. And I think Jason has a awesome campground in store for us tonight. Up around... Oh, I'm Jason, remember? Jason. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, right? 
Grayson. <laughs> Someone in the back of Billy goes on the left hand track. I can't tell you. Next to a tree. Top secret. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So maybe hang around and see where we're going to camp tonight. It's freaking mint. All right, guys. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Last night, stayed out the back of the hotel there. Uh, we're going to drop on the Crooked River, do that, uh, and then we're going to make our way towards Billy Goat. So, camp up at the Pinnacles tonight, that's the plan. Whether it happens or not, we'll see what the conditions are at the track. Uh, possibly snow. So, stay tuned and see how we go. So we're going to be home a day or two early. <laughs> All right, fellas, apparently it's really not a good weekend for Toyotas, and this may be a really short video now. Yeah. Um, old Barney boy here. Hey, young man. Yeah, I'm good. We're going to Dargo Pub. Yeah, we're going for... back to the pub. So yeah. it's the Dargo Pub yep. blog. I don't know. Was... I just heard this There's... tiny noise. I pull up. It was like, yeah, it's been smoking for hours. What are you doing? I'm like, I'm <laughs> blowing a head gasket. Oh, it's on so, so we think we've either done a head gasket or done a piston because there's smoke coming out the dipstick and there's it's pissing we, out white smoke. We hope there. it's a head gasket, but part of me wants it to be a piston because I have an LS to highlight and a low tight. LS3, LS8. 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 Oh, what about, you know, a barra? Imagine Do the barra. Turbo barra. Oh, no. <laughs> what about we don't do have this problem? <laughs> Come on, alright, so a um, couple of dramas, we're going to head back to the pub, see if we can sort it out. Hopefully it works out, hopefully we can maybe fix it and keep it on the tracks. Oh, that 
What do you reckon, Az? Cooked. Cooked? Bad timing. <laughs> That's not good. Right. Keep going, Barn! I'm really happy it happened here, yeah. Oh, yeah. rather than on some stupid track. Yeah. Absolutely. Like shit that has happened all together, yeah. for sure. But that's never good for Honestly, anyone. I feel real bad for him. I'm... Eric's <laughs> <laughs> feeling sorry for himself. I'm surprised that right. hasn't happened earlier. <laughs> yeah. I've seen a few yeah. things. Poor bastards. That's all horrible. Right. Oh, all right, let's go. Hang into it. Oh, well. Shit happened. We got even oil on the ground. Oh, well. A little flick. <laughs> well, that ended quickly. Uh, we got halfway up the hill out of Dargo, probably 10k out of town, maybe, if that. And uh, yeah, the Legend X Hilux started blowing smoke everywhere found out that it's probably done a piston so not looking good so we had a cut unbroken <laughs> alright so uh, when are you guys going to send a towie out? Yeah, Mate, we're heading out, we can't stick around, we've got to go. Oh yeah, half an hour be great. Thanks mate, speak soon. Bye. Bugger you I was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this Barney? Oh, is that Barney, I saw the Rego Legend decks. Yeah, Barney, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> oh man! I checked the Indian chick, like, hello, never heard of you, so good, okay, no fixie. <laughs> While we waited for a phone call to see if Barney could get his truck picked up, we popped into the pub for a quick feed. The chicken palmies at the Dargo Hotel are too good, we couldn't not get one. Now to plan a new route for the day, being a few hours lost and a car down. Gonna be for a while, so we might just uh, have a cannery, mate. Well, old mate's cars waiting for a towie. We better eat and feel a belly. Parma chips and gravy, I reckon. Good, thanks. Probably don't even have to look at the menu. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. That is a lot of different farmers. Like traditional Hawaiian, Aussie meat lovers. I don't know what that says. Sicilian. Sicilian. There you go. Bolognese, barbecue, and avocado. Oh. Which one are you going, mate? I had the barbecue on last night. Yeah. You know, I was here. The other car, that one actually tickles and fancy a bit. Radio, so Barney's car's all organised for now. It'll get sorted out, poor fella. So we have just left Argo, um, cruising out to Billy Goat's Bluff now. So stay tuned and yeah, hopefully you find some snow up there. High country action, Hi, mate. I'm keen as. Finally airing down. <laughs> it's about time. <laughs> what is it? Six morning. o'clock in the arvo. Time <laughs> to have some glorious fun She's in the bloody high the country. Have you seen it? She's up and moving. Yeah, I'm deep. locking. Yes, you do. Yeah. Like she, deep, deep. I reckon it's up probably half a metre at least since when we did it last. Yeah. Well, that was quite low. I must admit. Yeah, but that was still three quarters wheel height when we did it, so mm. I reckon it's going to be lapping the bonnet. But you know what's more exciting? Folks, me. We saw oh. snow caps. How cold is it now, I though? I saw the snow caps, My brother. nipples are... <laughs> <laughs> the cut's going to be top here. <laughs> um, 
But we saw them. Yeah. So we know what we're, we know what we're chasing. There is snow there. There is snow. Yeah. Mighty river crossing here. That's deep. <laughs> it's a little bit deeper than what we've normally done, but we're confident. It's usually only about three, four mil deep. It's probably up about half a metre, so we're talking maybe a metre at the absolute most. All those cars are well equipped for that, so we're, pr we're pretty good. Gonna give it a go. Let's have a look. Here we go. Yeah, beauty. That was way too long in the water. <laughs> That's a crossing. That is good. Alright fellas, if you've never been here before, this is the helipad halfway up Billy Goat's Bluff. So we're on Billy Goat Bluff track now. See the rest of the track there behind us? So it's, it's one of those tracks, if you haven't done it before, you got to do it. It's not a hard track. It used to be half decent, now they've graded it, it's pretty pretty good. Yeah, so we're hoping for a bit of snow up here, but yeah, it doesn't seem to be happening.
not her. <laughs> well, mate, here we go. Here we are. Rosticles on your mow, mate. <laughs> <laughs> so good.
makes these oh, dwarves really? so small? I think Three foot bloody dwarves. I think what makes the high country so different is it's vases, but it's huts. Morocco? Morocco? Morocco, yeah. Morocco. 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 You, you guys have been here a few times before? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I love the high country, it was the first time ever. We got a bit of white stuff. We got, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. got him. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like a champ, mate. Hey. Took it like a champ. That's what we needed, bro. I love it. Yeah. As is for picturesque, eh? You never know what you're going to come across as you're driving down the road. Trip done mate, here we are, La Cola, aired up, ready to head back home. Barney, as Jay staying another night, but me, you and Steve, time, yeah, no, to, mate. time to get to work. Back to work tomorrow, spewing, eh? Found a bit of snow, uh, nothing too hard for drive-wise, but just a bit of exploring and showing Show the boys. Around. Yeah, showing the boys from up north, a bit of uh, down south. Exactly right, cold down south. But yeah, no, it's been bloody awesome, so I'll, let's hit it. Time to hit the road.